finding information about your Windows 11 PC such as installed memory, OS build, installed hardware and finding errors and their causes on your PC could be a tedious task. In this video, we will see how to find critical system information about your Windows 11 PC. Checking System Properties You can check various details about your system by going through the system properties. To access this information, you need to open the File Explorer. Here, right click on this PC and select properties. You can also reach here by opening the settings then under the system tab scroll down and click on about. Here you will see several details. On the top of this window you will see the PC name. You can also rename the PC. Then below this you will see the device specifications. Here you will see several details such as device name, processor, Installed RAM, Device ID, Product ID, System Type, whether it is 64-bit or 32-bit based processor. Then you will see Pen and Touch options. If you go a little down, you will see Windows Specifications, the addition of the operating system, its version, installation date, the operating system build and the Windows Experience Pack. You can also copy these details and paste them anywhere to save or send these details. Detailed System Information To see detailed system information about your PC, you can use the System Information applet. To open it, click on the Start menu and type System Information. Click on it to open. Then here, by default, you will see System Summary, which contains detailed system information. Apart from the basic information that you see on the system properties page, you will see extra details like system model, manufacturer, BIOS information, baseboard information, windows directory, system directory and then detailed memory information. Here on the left hand side, you will see three categories, hardware resources, components and software environments. If you expand hardware resources, you will see various details like conflicts and sharing, forced hardware, input output, interrupt requests, and memory. If we expand the components, we see various components attached to our PC, such as display, network, storage, printing, USBs. We can also see the problematic devices. Then in the software environment, we will see details on the system drivers, print jobs, running tasks, loaded modules, services and other details. Checking installed devices. If you want to check the installed devices on your Windows PC, you can check it in the device manager. So. Click on the start menu and type device manager. Click on it to open. Here you will see all the devices installed. The default view is devices by type. So if you expand a device, you will see all the devices nested in here. You can also change the view by clicking on the view menu. Getting information on errors in Windows 11. If you want to get information on errors in Windows 11, you can open it by searching the start menu then click on it to open. Here you will see three main categories, custom view, windows logs, applications and services log. This first view here is the custom view, which you can create and view your specific type of errors. If you expand the windows logs, we will see errors and information related to application, security, setup system and forwarded events. In the applications and services log, you will see several categories related to applications and services. Let's see how to use custom events in the event room. To do that, 
we can click on the action menu and select create a custom view or you can directly select it from the right side view. Here in the first field you can select the duration then select the event level from critical or warning, verbose, error or just information. Then you can select the filter by log or filter by source. You can then add keywords to look for. If you want to fetch the record of a connected remote computer, you can add the user for the remote computer. That's it for this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, drop them below and share this useful video with your friends and family. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to press the bell button to receive alerts for videos on Windows tips and tricks.